Hi, uh, good morning. Today we will learn about the working of a four-stroke petrol engine with the help of an animation. So let's see the animation. Uh, so I think you have seen uh, the animation, the movement of the piston. So we have four strokes involved in a four-stroke uh, petrol engine. First one is suction, second one is compression, third is ignition, and fourth is exhaust. So in this four-stroke, we will be receiving one power stroke. This involves the crankshaft uh, rotation of 720 degrees. That is 720 divided by 4. That means 180 degree. One stroke involves 180 degree of crankshaft rotation. So let's see how it is happening. So in the suction stroke, the piston will be at the top dead center. So the piston will be moving from the top dead center towards the bottom, resulting in the first stroke and the first 180 degree of crankshaft rotation. At this point, the inlet valve will be in open condition and exhaust valve will be in closed condition. So uh, here, a normal uh, depression is created inside the cylinder as the piston moves from the top towards the bottom. That means uh, a depression below the atmospheric pressure, that is 30 kilopascal or 0.3 bar, which results in the uh, air fuel mixture to be sucked inside naturally. So it, this is called a naturally aspirated engine. So that's how suction happens. In the next stroke of crankshaft rotation from 180 degree to 360 degree, the piston moves from bottom dead center towards the top dead center. Uh, in this point, uh, both inlet valves and exhaust valve will be in closed condition and the air fuel mixture which has already been sucked in will get compressed. So this will be happening in a, a pressure of about 800 to 1300 kilopascal. That means 8 uh, to 13 bar. And the fourth stroke, uh, the crankshaft rotation will be from 360 degree to 540 degree. Uh, that means the piston moves from top dead center towards the bottom dead center. At this point, both inlet and exhaust valves will be in closed condition. And here the ignition is happening. The spark will be happening in this stroke. And as a result of this, a combustion will happen. And this will result uh, exerting a pressure on the top of the piston which helps the piston to move down here is exactly how we uh, receive the power for the crankshaft to further rotate and this is the final stroke here the piston moves from bottom dead center towards the top dead center and here the inlet valve will be in closed condition and exhaust valve will be in open condition so the smoke which has been accumulated inside the cylinder in the previous ignition stroke will be pushed outside uh, through the exhaust valve so uh, here the uh, crankshaft rotation is a 720 degree that means in these four strokes we receive uh, one single power stroke so that's that's uh, what it has been shown over here suction compression ignition and exhaust in 720 degree of crankshaft rotation and one power is received so i believe you got the working of a four stroke a petrol engine for more details you can visit my blog and, uh, and other technical videos you can visit my YouTube channel over here. Uh, thanks for watching.